Hey guys, Abs here. In the next few moments, I'm going to be showing you exactly how I was able to find out of a website that's actually been hacked. Um, so I actually found out and came across this yesterday when I was when I was making a demonstration video of the website SEO analysis software. So I'm going to give you a quick demo quickly exactly of what I done to find out that this website was hacked. So the actual website in question is socialmonkey.com. I know many of us have actually used this website, guys. Um, well, I haven't personally used them, but I know many of you guys and many other users are actually using Social Monkey, um, and as a result I actually use them to gauge exactly what kind of keywords they're targeting um, so I can go and replicate the exact same thing um, and get and, and leverage the traffic over to Soshi Sind. Um, so I'm gonna end I'm gonna quickly write something in here build backlinks okay it's only a very quick demo guys um, it shouldn't take long um, give this two moments to finish up the PR and um, everything here and voila that's been done what we can do now is actually click on export to csv i'll call this social monkey okay again guys you can do reports for 10 at a time um, i'm going to open this up now okay so here's social monkey so obviously the url um, we've got all the details down here social monkey is a pr3 um, forget all these link counts and everything down here um, the title's totally fine don't worry about them though but um have a look at these headings so total headings is one and if we actually have a look at the heading the actual heading for that h1 tag sorry it's a h2 tag um it's porno porno i don't know isle escort bayan escort bayan um you know fairly um in istanbul escorts um so i think they're using the turkish language and they're using the english language um but all related to poor pornography um okay so let's have a look total images with alt okay don't worry about that that wasn't something that concerned me another area that concerned me was total external links total external links were 16 that's fine somebody can have 16 links from their website however when you go over to the external link with anchor text you can actually see that they've got porno, porno is all, escort, or whatever the actual key, um, keywords they've got that are linking out. So obviously these are external links. So from this report, it's very easy for me to see that these are external links that are going out to porno sites. And it's also easy for me to see um, that, that they're using heading tags um, or a H2 tag for a very bad keyword. Um, well, which is a nothing related to Social Monkey. Um, obviously, you've got many more details down here that you can go through as well. I'm not looking to actually show you a full demonstration of the SEO software analysis tool in action. Um, if you do want a copy, guys, then you can get it free as a bonus um, when you buy um, Rank Recon. Um, and I think today's the last day. But I'm going to go over to Social Monkey now and actually do some searches. Okay, so I'm going to do a Control F and look for porn. OK, and nothing comes up for porn on the actual website, uh, which is kind of strange. So, well, it isn't actually strange. If it was hacked, guys, um, then what you'd realize is that you won't be able to see anything on the website because everything will be in the source as hidden. So what we can do is actually go to view page source. And when I view page source, I can do a control F again and type in porn. And as you can see here, guys, here, here's all the dirty stuff. OK, so style text equals CSS. OK, and display none. So it's basically telling it, OK, we're giving you this information, but we don't want you to display it on the actual website. OK, it's a H2. OK, and obviously the ID or, or whatever the ID of the CSS they've called it is Catman. And they're actually styling the Catman a H2 um, so that it's not shown. OK, and then obviously you've got these links here. I'm not going to click on these links. Um, you can see the titles here as well. Pornos and the anchor text here as well. Um, porno is also. Um, and they've got lots of links out here going to really bad websites, guys, um, which you don't want. I'm not sure how long these have been on here for. Um, these guys have still got a page rank three. They're still inside. Well, they're still um, indexed in the search engines. Obviously, if you type in Social Monkey into Google, they're still indexed as well. So if any of you guys are friends with Social Monkey guys, um, maybe, you know, you could get in contact with them and make them aware. Um, I personally don't know them. Um, I just wanted to send out this video to let you know exactly how beneficial an SEO analysis tool can be. Um, especially um, for picking up data that you don't see on the website, but it's actually, but you actually see it on the back end. Um, one other area that we have actually um, made a few changes on, guys, from yesterday's video, I just want to point out, um, is um, the bold words, underlined words, and and italic words. Um, yesterday's video, I uh, made you aware of how we pick up bold words and underlined words and italic words, um, but we actually give you a number as well. So we don't do that, and it didn't tell you what was bold, what was italic. Um, 
um, um, what was underlined, but now they do. So bold words, these are all the words you see here are gonna be in bold. Um, underlined words, everything you see in here, they're gonna be underlined. And obviously you can go ahead and check all these out from here as well, um, which is totally fine, guys. Um, but yes, again, guys, it's a very simple, straightforward tool. Um, it really helps you get some insights of what's going on on a website. Um, and, and, and you know, um, just by chance, um, I was able to find out what's going on with Social Monkey. It'd be a shame for these guys to get penalized. It'd be a shame for these guys to lose their page rank. Um, so, um, so yeah, you know, if they had a, if they had access to a tool like this, um, then they'll be able to get rid of that straight away. So thank you very much, guys, and I hope you enjoyed finding out exactly how you can f um, see details of a website and find out if they've been hacked or if there's anything on the website that could be causing or could be an issue for them to get penalized for. So thank you very much, and I hope you enjoyed the video.